Hello everyone and welcome to Chatelaine Makes. I'm Lorraine. So hopefully this video will be in sync as a lot of people commented on my last video that uh, my voice and the video is not in sync. So you know, what, what I plan on doing is uh, I checked out some other editing programs and I'm going to try a different one this time. So with that being said, I have Happy Mail. So this I know, this is my winnings from Antoinette of two OGs, Hook and Stitch and Island Style. All I did was just open the end. I know what this is. So I have a little card here. grab the end without grabbing the card inside. Okay, oh a nice little card. These look like they're handmade. Designer greetings. Hmm. Uh, okay, so I can read her note. Uh, it says, congrats on winning my birthday giveaway. There are few goodies along with the bod drive, the flash drive. Can't wait to see what you make. Lots of love and hugs from Deer Island. Love, Antoinette. Thank you. Very nice card. Okay, now I have to cut this again. Oh, I didn't think it was that any extras. I thought it was just going to be a note in the bod drive. So, surprise for me. Oh, sorry for the noise. Oh, there we go. I'm good. Okay, that's everything out. Okay. I'll take it. This is the this is the flash drive in here. Have some tea, some spiced apple herbal tea, ginger peach. Oh, I think this might be nice if it was um, chilled after. And Ruabas, Ru I Boss red tea. Never heard of that one before, so that'll be interesting. I'm not that big of a tea drinker. I do like spiced tea. So, uh, but I will give those a try and see how they turn out. My uh, Antoinette's known for postcards from Deer Island. So we have this one here is, there we go, uh, lobster pound, snow and lobster traps. Or is that Deer Island? We have this one here. Uh, Deer Island Princess. Link between Deer Island and the mainland. I wonder if that's the one that Antoinette is usually works on. And uh, we have this one here. Uh, Deer Island Point. Oh, Deer Island Point Park at Half Tide with North America's largest whirlpool. And one more. This one says Breakwater, Wharf, and Pound in. Sorry, I have to bring it closer. Leonard Bill Harbor, Deer Island. Oh, they are so nice. And I also got some of Antoinette's homemade stitch markers. So let's see, what did I get? Oh, I got one of the ones that she does. What's this one have on it? 
Oh, this is nice. You should take mix with the uh, cabochons. Sorry for the glare. It says follow your heart. Very nice. Thank you, Antoinette. From 2OG Soaking in Stitch and Island Style. I will put her link in the description below. Has show you some progress on the Kristen gown that I'm making. I have started the skirt area. So maybe you can sit a little better this side here. This is very going to take me a lot longer than it took for the other ones because I had to go down to a 1.75 millimeter hook, which I have only used uh, in the past with um, crochet thread. So, and I am using a number three weight uh, Barnett Softy Baby, which I showed in my last video and commented on how much it splits. It could split because I'm using a very small hook. I don't know. Um, so, and then you also use um, two other progressively larger hooks. Right now I have moved to a 2.1 because I cannot find my 2. And then I'm going to switch that out for a 2.3. Sorry about my hair, folks. I had a shower and uh, have my... Oh, it's way back there. I have my um, wrap that I usually put for my in my hair, but because the fact that my hair is longer, it and bunched in the back, I usually have to put a suck and tell over top. So that's that. Um, I also took some notes on the comments for the for Connie from Just Another Stitches. A collaboration giveaway. <coughs> Excuse me. As I did not want to make the comments on the video before the draw, which is coming up um, the last day to enter comments on the hashtag Connie's Just Because Collaboration or Collab Giveaway is. March 19th, so that's coming up soon. So don't forget. Um, I will try to link uh, Connie's playlist. And uh, for that, don't forget to make your comments. Anyways. Um, so, Carl Ann C. I think it's Carl Ann C. that made this comment. I am on the list. I am number 17. Um... And could you please check to see if you have multiple comments on there? And if you do, just delete out the, just delete, delete out and just leave one comment. Anyone else who thinks they may have uh, made more than one comment, please go back and check. Um, because you do not want to be disqualified for having more than one comment because... What I will have to do is I will have to go through and delete at least one of somebody's comment that commented more than once because it is just uh, fair to leave one comment and I don't really want to filter out um, uh, filter out um, duplicate users uh, because I noticed at least one person did not answer the question asked. Uh, it is a Carl Ann, but this is Carl Ann Pop, P 
P-O-P-P-E. Uh, please go back and rewatch the original video and uh, edit your comment according to the question asked. Otherwise, if your name comes up the way your comment is now, you will be disqualified. Okay, because one of the requirements was that you did need to answer the question that was asked. Okay, um, Jody F. Uh, prayers for your son. Hope uh, your son um, is doing as well as can be. Um, then I have Christina M. I feel your pain. I have been dealing with the toothache. Uh, several different uh, teeth on this one side for quite some time. I'm just not in um, position right now to go and have them pulled because they're going to have to be pulled and I have I counted at least three and I'm sure they're all impacted. Um, this is so I feel you. Uh, Melanie Titus, hope you feel better soon. Uh, Sean, hope your mom is doing better. Um, I just have my notes here, that's why I keep looking over this way. Uh, Taylor, happy belated 31st anniversary. Um, as well as Deborah, happy belated birthday. Uh, Pamela H., very sorry for your family's loss last year. Um, Jennifer R, hope you're feeling better. As well as Cecilia M, I hope your grandsons are getting better. Uh, my daughter and my son-in-law both had, got COVID last December. And uh, thankfully they recovered. Whether they have long-term long side effects later on, we don't know. But for the most part, they've recovered, both back to work. So that's a good thing. Um, Patricia W, I hope your garage sale went well. And Sandra loves crochet. My father picked out my name. And uh, my husband decided to uh, use it for my youngest daughter's middle name. And Ruby L, I wish you a speedy recovery. And that is my notes for the comments, or from the comments on the uh, Connie's Collab giveaway. I will be going back after the, I picked my semi-finalist and actually putting comments in, or replies to the, to the comments in there. Um, I think that's out of except. I do plan on yarning, of uh, yarning, hand dyeing some cotton yarn tomorrow, fingers crossed. I have my water salted, so, um, and I am using pickling salt for that, because uh, I could not find any other non-iodized salt where I live, so pickling salt, and uh, from watching other YouTubers, I do know that pickling salt works well. So I am using a different um, method and uh, using salted water and heating the water. So we will see how that turns out and that will be a two-part video um, because I'll take you through the, the dyeing process and then in the first part and then the second part will be um, after it's dried, I'll show you the results. Yep, that's it. I have nothing else right now. Um, today is, I think, Tuesday, 17th, whatever 17th is. That's what day it is. I think it's Tuesday. Um, being retired, it's the one day seems like the same as they all seemed the same. Um, stores here are open seven days a week, so. You can't even go by that as it, you know, before stores used to be closed on Sunday, so you knew when, when it was the weekend um, that you couldn't go shopping. So, anyhow, 
uh, I will let you go now. Hope you have a nice uh, this late evening. So whenever you see this, probably tomorrow, I hope you have a nice rest of your week. And until next time, this is Lorraine Chatelaine Makes, signing off.